for today. Supposed to live here. Hate to work late on Fridays. <sighs> Too tired to break it. Better use the device. for extra people. Oops, it was an accident. Shit, just like always. Let's see, room number six. Let's find it and go home. Nice costume, pal. There a party around here somewhere? This is gonna get me tons of likes! Behold, your time has come. Wow, cool voice. This is your last moment. Prepare. Okay, I'm prepared. Go on. Shit, the battery is deader than I am. Okay, dude, I'll charge your junk. You take me out of this world, and we done, okay? Hey, where's your cool voice? It was a phone app. Love it. Bloody hell! I would type how to get rid of guest, but I won't. You never know what you left on the hard drive. You never know what you left on the hard drive. Cyborg OS. That explains a lot. Let's plug in and forget. Wait! There are no holes here! I thought removing the audio jack was the revolution! Let the owner tell me how to charge his junk. How is this cyborg-based can supposed to be charged? Through the power of lightning hitting eternal space and making it vibrate. Wireless. Damn. I gotta figure this out. There are only two things in my lair I can think of wireless. Internet and working microwave. My anger is about to start boiling over. But actually, there's no difference between these thumbs. This powerful fruit can raise the price of any gadget. Even a fridge. The gold is fake. This thing is peeling off, showing the dirt underneath. Welcome to the online world. 
I call it Golden Butt, to be brief. Iceman is the man of ice. This Chinese soup is not much younger than China. Rotten tomato? Oof, luckily it's not, and my finger's clean. Eh, sticky. Hmm, still crisp. I merged a fruit with a robot. The world could collapse! Oh my god. It's still dead. Waves are too weak? Now imagine that's your stomach. Coloration process has begun. Bag still full. It seems cleaner than the microwave. It works! All we need is a final sweep. <laughs> now the waves are free to penetrate. This could be a damn good tutorial. Wow, dude, the power of waves. I can smell that power. Or was it my morning snack? Call me a reviver, cause your phone is alive! Step back! So this another world trip is for real? Real as I am for everyone. <laughs> I'm in! Gonna make greatest vlog of all time! Don't you fear the stinky breath of another realm? Lonely, eternal flow in the endless horizon? Look man, my channel is dying. Advertisement rates are getting lower for me. If I don't upload something hot, I'll have to get a real job, man! In my nightmares, I'm a taxi driver, janitor, or construction worker. No more free stuff. No money for my iron butt. This is every blogger's worst fear. Fine. Okay, my dear subs, just wait for me to return. Like my vids, subscribe. Our adventure begins. Oh, almost forgot. This is gonna be too boring. Yep. Let me fix it. I hate my job. What is this place? The station between two worlds. One is underground, and the other is above. And the one and only place I can relax and change my clothes. Unfortunately, my cloak is not immortal. 
Don't drink too much or you'll die. There's no dial here. Special line. You can make a death call. Don't touch it. It's mine. Come on. Bloggers always get VIP access for free. I'm a blogger. Dead one. Should it be turned on? Greetings, Stat Traveler. Forces of Evil Unlimited are pleased to meet you and provide you a great ride to hell. Are you controlled by the evil AI robot? Perhaps, but so are you. I'll call you Siri. No, they'll give me a multi-million dollar fine. Maybe no name? But the safest way is to leave you nameless. Do I have to pay you something? No, the ride is free. Enjoy your voyage. Eat, drink, with no limitations. There are small additions to the standard Dead Traveler's Agreement, but you'll know them once you arrive in hell. Damn, just like at my bank. Get me a drink. Stirred, but not shaken. This recipe is made exclusively for one specific person. Please take the champagne. All right, call the train. Destination, hell! Hey, buddy, listen here. What are you? A free gift for riding to hell? I need your help, man. Really, take me to hell. What's the problem? Tickets sold out? I'm just stuck here, man. Kind of station staff. So I'm not allowed to leave without permission. I wish I could say that I'm dying here. But I'm not. Eternal work. What could be worse? So true. Are you a small devil? Of course not. I was a regular guy from the street, you know? Rap, gangs, and such things. That elevator and I found myself here in this body. Since then, I work here. Carrying luggage, cleaning the robot, washing the dishes. Does regular work for a guy like me, you know. Like you? You mean... Yeah, my natural appearance. You said that. I didn't mean anything like that. Relax, homie. So you don't care that we talked about your nature? I said relax. Are you sure? Absolutely. Damn, you crazy four eyes. Do really deserve a ticket to hell. Are you a gangster? No, I'm a gangster. Go with the flow. Rap is my weapon, my life is a battle. Stay away, homie, my verbal snake's about to rattle. Now I see why you are dead. How can I help you? Get some papers that will let me leave. Did you ask him to take you to hell or heaven? Guys from above told me my lyrics won't fit in their shiny, cloudy rooms. Those hell freaks wrote a letter that hell is not big enough to carry my rap. Can you believe it? Um... Oh, they put me here in these stupid clothes. No audience at all except this talking junk. I can hear you. Might come in handy. This Hell Station Bridge is sponsored by the money the government stole from you. Thank you. What's that supposed to mean? Are visitors supposed to have a phone after death to make phone calls? Nice move from tech support. 
Now I can tell this other world support everything that I always wanted to say to their colleagues in my world. You have called the L support line. You don't need to push any buttons. With us, you don't need help anymore. Just go to hell. Best support ever. Ah, cold. Hello? Who needs a new popular angel? Nobody's here. What is it? Better call death. Number is 555-123-256. Wow, really? I'm not a vandal. The tape's just so old that it sticks to my fingers. Silence is calling for me. I'll be back. Watch out! Copyright is everywhere! Don't drink from my glass! Don't tell me I have to pay to get the microphone! Hey, you've just rapped some lines. So, you're a rap artist, right? I'm the king of the battle. Call your grave digger, man. I kill you like cattle. Every word raises sharp. I'll be damned. Yeah, boy. Um, okay. Do you happen to have your personal mic? Don't have a doubt. I painted it by myself. I know this sounds bad, so stay calm. But can I borrow it? I'd rather give some other part of me. Like my fist. Hey, I'm working on how to free you. Okay, sorry. S street reflexes, you know. I'll have to get everything ready to open the safe before Reaper comes back. Try this. I have to finish, um, the thing I'm trying to make. All right, what's next? Think. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one. How could I get to heaven? No one's there! There aren't many candidates that can be allowed in heaven. As you see, their platform is pretty old and outdated. No visitors. No need to upgrade. Sing some death metal! Wow. The mic was stolen by some musicians. They died because of drugs. And now they steal. What kind of people are they? Strangers in the night. Here it is, the cold breath of death. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse. Ah, oh, what a 
forgot the lyrics. As a horse and some something. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse. Here you go. Thanks, man. My respect. What's your name, homie? As a horse I'm Angelo. Nice name for this place. I'm Demon. Demon? Deem on, man. Deem on. By the way, you want me to be your sidekick? You ass-kicking, cool, and brutal gangster sidekick. Hmm. Rap dude can add some views to my vids. You're in. Angelo and Demon go to hell. Challenge accepted. Word, bro. I'm your Swiss Army knife. Destination? Hell. Let's get it. Books train arriving in two thousand years. Here we are. What next? Blow this place up. My goal is to explore all the curious corners of hell. Shoot some stuff to make the hottest video for my channel. Then my plan is to get my ass out of here. So let's try to take a kind of tour and find the person who's in charge of this ugly place called hell. I could possibly meet some of my buddies. I used to wish lots of them a nice trip here. Excuse me, may I? Hello? Hello? Maybe it's another robot. Hey, boy! Searching for some dead bones? Hey, what's up, dog? I know how it feels. You on your own in the city, and loneliness kills. Please, stop. I get it. I guess the time is dead here, too. One hell of subway route! Hey, brother! You want a ride? Are you a taxi driver? My name is Ben, and I'm a biker first of all. Wait, is that yellow toy your bike? That's my punishment for my worst sin. Did you kill someone with your smell? It was a betrayal of my best friend. Woman? Ah, same old stuff. Woman? How can you compare a woman to a real friend? My love and loyalty were always dedicated to two wheels. Wow, a biker love story. You know nothing about such love, boy. So just listen. It was a dark and rainy night. My gut was burning, and I needed an extinguisher from the liquor store. And my cousin's car was parked right near the door. I was feeling bad and took the steering of this four-wheel wagon. All I could remember was my lonely friend looking at me through the foggy glass of the damn car. After I got to the end of my life's road, I realized that I will never be forgiven for touching a car. Can I have kind of a tour around here? I can take the wheel, but I'm not your damn guide. So give me your vehicle and GPS navigator would be great. A biker never gives his friend away, even if he's ugly like your buddy. Forget it, son. Hey, take it easy, man. I have 865,762 subscribers. What did that dog do to get here? It was a man who offended animals. Kind of education. I'll write a bad review on you. Is there some kind of administration? Yes, all of one person. So will you get me to him? 
Even being in hell won't make me drive. That three-wheel embarrassment. But what about endless ribbon of asphalt? Wind in your face, flies in your nose. That's what bikers need to live. I know that. I watched a video. Hmm. What number will make you drive? I don't need money. I want to crush this deadly silence with sounds. The beat that will sink with my heart. Cause now it's stopped. Want me to rap you some killing lines? I said music. Rhythm ripping hell. Vibrance of a powerful voice. Any other options? Maybe wash your bike. Don't you dare touch it. Next Damn puzzles. Something's wrong. Touching it equals touching me, boy. Hey, Dumont, take a look at this hole. There's something down there. Looks like some modern designed underground club. Maybe you could lower me down? No way, homie. Your iron butt looks too heavy. It has to be like that in our profession. Free ride! Wow! I've never been to the seashore in my life. Sometimes, when you buy a trip, ads promise you beautiful landscapes, sun, yachts, women in bikinis. But in reality, it looks just like this place. Just a dog and some guy. What's that thing doing here? Maybe that fancy dude knows. So cute. Better ask that man first. Maybe this is some modern music clip? Better talk with that man. Hey, this is state property. No use without my permission. What state? I am the law on this piece of hell. And my sacred duty is to not let something go for free. Hey, mister. What happened? You look sad. Like you ate a piece of bad apple for breakfast. You know, boys, I used to be a respectable citizen. Man of duty, rich and powerful. I used to be a person. You a stockbroker, right? Bad luck, and you made your way right down here? I hate stockbrokers. Ha! <laughs> I was an official man of office. Government contracts, state budgets, military procurement. Oh, oh the good old days. I hate men of office. Some loved me, some hated me. I was a politician. Easy, demon. I know what you feel. If you are a man of politics, I'll call you Mr. B. Can we rent your fishing rod, sir? Perhaps, but you have to show me some respect. You are going to use resources that belong to hell people. So only a state person like me can protect it. Curry favors. Speak humbly. Bribe me. Damn! He sounded like a woman I used to. <clears throat> no. Does something live in this green, stinky sea? Some organisms can live anywhere. So true, Mr. Politician, isn't it? The problem is that there's not any bait that can survive in this water. And that fish can only be eaten by another hell creature. Is that cute puppy yours? A member of my team. 
Does it bark when someone doesn't agree with you? In such a case, I can bark myself. That dog barks only when the news is on TV. Does that tank guard you or guard us from you? Or wait, I got it. All weapons are a human curse. So ultimately, they all end up in hell. Justice! Silly little kid. Weapons are being exported from hell. Big deal. Honestly, I'm jealous of whoever supervises this process. Wow, news from hell. Can you show us? It's a translation from the world of the living. Fits hell perfectly. I was receiving a signal from those antennas on the island. But one day the signal was lost. Have you tried to speak with the owner? Ha! I'm the one who needs to be talked with. Can we bum some cash from you, Mr. P? Of course not. The state cut the budget this year. Ah, as always. No money here, my friend. He'll never let us take it. Who needs his approval? Here you go. Cash only. Did you chisel it from him? Money's wasn't in the bank or my man's pocket. He has no right to hold the moolah. It's the people's cash. You know, once I played a game called Island, but it looked more beautiful there. Just Island? Developers didn't put too much <clears throat> creative work in that title. All right, I'll take this bowl and you can fly near me. You know nothing about style, brother. Watch and learn. I'm always scared of fast, rotating things. Just imagine, we've stopped the force of nature with the money. It's always like that, dude, and always was. Opens. Now we free to do what we want. No law breaking, Mr. Angel O. Wait. I can hear something like a movie. He is watching an adult movie, I tell you. What? No one watches that without headphones. Maybe he's gaming. Let's listen. Hi, I'm Sonia. And I'm locked in my room. <laughs> what did I tell you? Wow, this thing is kissed by lightnings! Who is the smart one? No leaves? No problem. Can you bring this thing down? Lightning catcher can come in handy. My versatile body, right? I hate my job. I don't have enough force, so speed to crush it. Jeez, giant spider web. I don't want to come any closer. Why should I fly right into the web? Try to knock that iron thing down from the roof. Web should give you some acceleration. Stop talking like a boxing coach.
I have some news that TV broadcast is live again. All right, you can check by yourself. Or do you want me to change channels for you? You always do when it comes to elections. I made it bark! What for? Cool! We've got the vocal talent! Only after me. Holy cow! Just look at this beauty! I'll be damned if I don't try it. I can hear music in my head already! Jump in, ma- Demon! Push the button! What are you waiting for? Why is it always happening with sports cars? Maybe because of the speed any driver thinks he can handle. Hello, are you cleaning hell? Psst. I hear them. They are coming. <laughs> Waiting. Building. Careful, never stay still. Move. I... Who's after you? Wet rags you forgot to hang dry? Can you see them? Oh, you are like the others. Blind, all of you will die. So you are my savior from what or who? Ants. Even hell is in a hideout from them. All my life, I fought against them. Ruined empires. But they hold the defense. They are building a foothold for real troops. What do you mean? Yes! All their bulk mass is controlled by the central brain. But they are so small. It's construction workers who deploy a lot of their bases. Real soldiers are already on the way here from outer space. Giant killer ants! Ah! I am the last bastion! And I will guard the entrance! Kill them all! Your glasses must be powerful, cause I can't see any of them. Here they are! On rails! I said not to stay still! Move! Move! Bye for now, weird warrior. Please check out that hole. Maybe you? What if it's a dangerous flesh-eating monster? Exactly. You don't look delicious at all. We woke him up. Stay asleep. Cute little tentacle. Stop it. Be a man. Which of us are you talking about? Uh. Take it, buddy. The ultimate weapon. Uh, thanks. Kill them all. All right, hell of a rhythm. Nice hell drum. I 
I heard something like that in my childhood. Remember making track of it myself. Let's mix some stuff. Okay, get ready to dive into music creation. Add some drums first. Hear and feel the vibe. Eight, let's make it sparksy. That's nice. I smell a hit track coming. Now, put some guitar. But I don't have any guitar recorded. For most people, heavy guitars sound all the same. Everyone just used the same sample. No, this sample doesn't fit. Let me try another one. Better? But still, not the one. Oh, yeah. You know what to do next, my apprentice, right? Okay, and here comes the magic of music. The skill that lets so many musicians be born on market. ta -dam! Come on, touch it. I know you want it. And that's how it's done by the masters. I will be a musician. Now let's go and present our track. Check this out, bro. All right, that sounds heavy. Jump in, boy, and spread your wings, because we'll fly. What is this? Famous hell bath? Aha! Especially good for curious nerds. Could you give me a lift to the shore? I'm already sick of that cable way. Too bad for you. But I can't. The Hell Road Ministry has been fixing this highway for over a decade. I'm so happy to see a gadget in someone's hands! Glass to head. What? Nice hospitality here. Hell, you know. Autocorrect. Mean glad to hear. Pretend we believe you. Look, man, 90% of my speech is made that way, but you shouldn't come with that. Next step is a sex doll, they used to say. Can't speak another way. Wait, is this some kind of challenge? Just tell me and I'm in. Cat acid. Wait, what? Tell me more. Cats are best sellers for any channel. Car accident. It's a pity. 
I was hoping to get a cat story. I mean, oh man. I was texting while driving. Autocorrect again? If no... Bastard! Real talk, man. I had no time to stop my Ferrari. Why you didn't make a voice call? Voice call? Now everybody talks through Instagram stories. Hell's guys weren't too smart, taking your voice from you. It changed nothing. Yep, now I can ignore everyone. But honestly, there's not many people to chat with through texting. You seem to know nothing about living right. Sea voyages with babes, illegal hunting, making drinking parties. Rich f***ing freak. Can we enter that nice building? You don't look like visitors to me. Even me? That's not allowed. Come on, let us in. We can't wait like those three fancy youngsters. Hell doesn't allow certain types of people to enter and enjoy the bar. And how do you decide which type we are? Don't tell me you have a psychology degree. He doesn't know the word degree. I ask questions. He probably wants to see if we fancy enough to enter this kind of club. We better act like some rich juveniles. All right, bring on your questions. Okay, first question. What is the penalty for hitting a pedestrian with your car? Your soul will never be at peace after that. Yep, and your car insurance won't either. Question number two. What is the average price for dinner? Another tricky question? I cook at home. It's the cheapest. Question number, uh, one, two, three. What's the sense in life? Sense is to find that what's sensible for you. Okay, you passed the golden youth test. Wait, you can allow visitors like Reaper, monsters, but no golden youth? Right, they must have something inaccessible here. Wow, hell seems to be fair. I got a feeling. I've seen this guy somewhere, but smile. Maybe he was happy to get here? Leave this bloody sphere alone. The only thing I can watch. Remembering good old times. <laughs> Look, Demon. We gotta make him forget about the balloon. Forget about everything. Don't know. Maybe make him happy by dealing with the hole in his head? The first person here that I know, the eternal evil. Um, nice to meet you. Yeah, I used to strike fear in tough guys. Keep the whole town terrified. But no more. <gasps> what happened, buddy? No more calls for kids' birthdays? Don't mention kids. I hate those little bastards. <gasps> Oh, they made a hole in my head with their slingshot. Kids' education's getting worse nowadays. Why you drink so much? The pain is oh, too much. And the hole in my head? In that scenario, you'll stay here forever. And this isn't bad. I know him! The scariest thing in the universe! You should see my hood before claiming that. What do we have here? Oh, it's really games from hell.
Hey, what's new in hell? Only visitors. Want something to drink? What's the drink of the day? Dubious colored stinky ooze. Half the liquor stores sell such things. Ugly and mouth sewn. That's a heck of a punishment for a bartender. Oh, and no tips, right? I'm still able to talk. No force can take that ability from a bartender. Who is that guy portrayed on the wall? Ah, it's Howard. Nice fellow, was. Was? He was a kind of reporter or something. Always carried a small notebook with a pencil. He seemed to be very interested in hell. He enjoyed discovering the surroundings and chatting with the locals. So what happened? Ordered some drink from you? He did. But after. Understand? After. Is he trying to tell us something? He made a private visit to the boss. Since then, his face lost a smile. I like that bottle. What's the deal? It's yours. You can't get water for free, but you can always get some alcohol. Wow! Even on the internet, I never saw a bartender's trick like this. No tricks. A good bartender is master of his bar. By the way, guys, do me a favor. You look tough enough. See that drinking guy? You mean the one with the hole in his head? Yeah, I don't like him. He drinks too much and can't stop. You, bartender. Don't like a customer who's had too many shots? I found another paradox in the universe. But no tips, remember? And no janitor to clean the floor. Don't even look at me with your owls. Easy, easy. What are you guarding? Some VIP room? This is the boss's private office. No visitors planned for the next hundred years. How do you know? Can't see a list or anything. The list is in my head. He's lying. Guards don't have anything in their heads. Is there a way you can add me to the visitors list? No. I will tear you in pieces if you try to enter. Unless you have a delivery. Is there a way you can add me to the visitors list? No. I will tear you in pieces if you try to enter. Unless you have a delivery. What kind of delivery? You tell me. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back. Let's rock this place! Does your almighty boss drink the same liquid? No, boss drinks a special one, cold death. Can you make me cold death? I wish. It requires ice, and it's not easy to get it here. What kind of bar doesn't have ice? Hell bar. That is your work. To sell half a glass of ice for the price of alcohol. But you need it urgently, right? And I don't ask who you and your dark friend are. So let's cooperate. Say something else about docs and I'll bite you. Where is ice? Don't say we have to wait for hell to freeze. No need to wait. There's a guy in the mountains, but he's a tough one to negotiate with. Maybe he died. <laughs> Best joke ever. Okay, wait for me. Winter is coming. Any tips on how not to die from cold? Or spells? 
The anti-cold spell I can remember was from a song. Song? Sounds nice to me. One girl fell away from her sister. Then she sang that song and became the master of cold, evil one. Sounds like she was a witch. All right. Here, eyes. No, copyright holders of that song will find me even here. If I only had a gun. Hi, do you speak some non hieroglyph language? Or just a language of force? Huh? Don't take it seriously. I don't want to fight with you. You guys are often shown as martial arts masters. I can speak. But you cannot hear. How did you manage to freeze hell? Me? <laughs> it's all the will of heaven. Ugh. Heaven? I thought this was another kind of department, you know? The will of heaven exists, even without heaven. Asian philosophy is so complicated. So you are strengthening your spirit, right? Meditation and stuff. Ugh, no, you dumb boy. Life is a river. And my leaf got into a muddy stream. Ahem, <laughs> what? Shit happens, he means. Ah, I was dying, as usual. I was expecting to be reborn. And once I woke up, I'm in hell. You said... As usual. It means you had few lives? Eh, like all of us. But not everyone realizes it. Eh, it was so convenient. I was a salesman. When buyers uncovered my frauds and uh, executed me, I was reborn and started over. I thought if you were a bad guy, you couldn't be normal human again. Nah, no big deal few months as a dung beetle, worm, can't even remember what else. But then, human once again. Then I became one of the Emperor's officials. Maybe it was a mistake to spend his money. I forgot that Emperor is called Son of Heaven. Will of Heaven punished me for this sin. Justice works for the rich. Why so angry about ice? You don't feel cold enough? Are you too greedy to let go of one piece of ice for us guys? My harmony is, uh, shifted. Ooh, cold ying exceeds yang. <laughs> um, Demon? He wants his butt to be warm. I thought your anger started a roaring fire in your ass. Wow! Nice decor for this place. Damn, this thing is alive! How are you? Nice to meet you. I'm a blogger with a million subs. Almost. And my friend... What do it want? Yeah, homie. Want some sick flow from me? I'm a killer like tequila. Spitting flames, not ice like vanilla. Isn't it dope, man? Tight rhymes. What? Your ears is just dead flesh. We could be a nice bloggers duo with this thing. What is that? Can I touch it? I say don't touch if you're not ready to go further, or the girl will slap your face. Hold your breath. Yes! Yes! Look! What happened? Only change I see is number 11 instead of 10. That makes you buzzing? I'm the happiest man in hell! You're worshipping the Iron Idol. People don't change. Where did you get such deep thoughts?
Is that your tomb on the cliff? And you are just a spirit, right? Hmm? Oh, that's the spirit ladder that only leads up. Okay, demon. Translate. Why don't you use it, old man? Oh, I tried to. And the will of heaven pushed me off into a freaking cold pit. Hey, Dimon, maybe we shouldn't just give him the bottle. Maybe we should put it in a plastic bag. Add a box of chocolate? Where did you see that? He must be grateful we didn't use this bottle to crack his head. Mr. P, let me speak from my heart. Take this gift as our appreciation for the work you've done. I always said that our young generation isn't lost yet. Hmm. Not much. Hook is empty and corroded. Like, by acid. Is that a sea of cola? Hey, if you're a staff worker in this world, so you have to own a versatile body to work in any condition? Wait, wait, wait. What's your point? I ain't gonna dive in there. You are the ultimate pocket knife. You said that, remember? And your cool jacket could attract some underwater chicks. Besides, you can't die. All right, let's do it. Wait, I'm immortal, but what about pain? Um... Nice catch! How is the... water? No worse than the Hudson River. Not sure who's gonna eat who. It stinks! Oh yeah, I remember this aroma. Just like mine. How about this thing? Made of dead wool. Ugh, my balance doesn't move right with this thing. It isn't warm enough. Alakazam! It's Instagram time! No clue what that means. But I'm in. Thanks! <sighs> now I feel the chi energy warms me up. But wait. There's no electricity here. How can you feel warm? It's just a cold piece of iron. Like my girlfriend. 
good thoughts and meditation. Works no worse than electricity. Besides, the will of heaven shouldn't see me warm, or it will put me in the fire. You tricky old bastard. If your skin can resist heat, cold must be blocked too. You won't make me dive into the snow and become white. Relax, I'm talking about saving cold inside. Take this piece, but don't swallow. Yeah, yeah, I know what you're saying about me. Here you go, Mr. Cocktail Maker. Express delivery, fast as hell, in a special container. With the taste of real man. I used to serve even worse drinks. Here is the cocktail. Say hello from me. Stay calm, buddy. This is for your boss. Hello. I was waiting for you. I'm all yours, boys. Do the first step, Angelo. Why me? I only have skills talking to video cameras. Hello, madam, or mademoiselle. We, my friend and I, came to you for help. Feeling a little confused about asking for a solution from the devil? Kind of. It happens much more than you think. The dark side is always more powerful, easier to master, and more effective, and looks attractive too, doesn't it? Men are always scared of a powerful woman, and attractive too. I can look as you wish me to. You can't know the real face of a devil. Exactly the same about women. You have a nice office. But we have to go. Can you let us go? Sure, darling. I can give you a return ticket. But I have to give you something, right? Nothing but another soul. Or serve me forever, and I won't need you here. What do you mean, serve you? Kill someone? Betray? Advertise online casinos? In any situation, just stay silent, and I'll win. The machine near the wall can absorb souls. Put one inside, and your exit will be paid. The machine will give you the ticket. Wow, hell is up to date. It always was, dear. And you are always welcome. By the way, if you get a chance to visit heaven, say hello to Michael. She just vanished. Like almost every girl after talking to me. <coughs> what was that? Hey, guys, come over here. If you need a real deal. Talking carpet? What do you need? Listen, guys. You were talking to the devil. Do you think she was sincere? Well, we are in hell and the arrangement sounds trustworthy. That sounds right, young man. But think again. She is the devil, and I'm not. Whose offer would you prefer? Why should we trust a rug from the devil's floor? Dudes in fancy suits only think about themselves. Not this time. I was a CEO of a big corporation. My life's motto was, see the target, don't see the obstacles. I was moving higher and higher, and became richer and richer at all costs, right? Business is a battlefield, boys. 
Deceive. Inveigle. Obfuscate. I heard that somewhere. It's truth. We all are selfish, but not all of us are brave enough to admit it. I use that as a motivating power. I see. It got to hell. My dear partner set me up, discredited me, and poisoned me in the end. So what's the price to trick the devil? My beloved son is left there. Poor boy is all alone in the jungles of business. I taught him everything I know. But sharks are swimming around him. The ones who sent me here. Tell him I have some dirt on them. And it's hidden inside King Midas' statue. No problem, boss. How can we reach him? Find the solution. Or do I have to think of everything? And don't think you can fool me. Ask him for the main words. And it will be our passphrase. Stay low. How did people text with this phone? It doesn't have a screen. Plastic. Modern times. Even in hell's main office. From this moment, every time I'll use an ATM, I'll remember that it stands in the devil's office. Will you hate money now? Or be scared of it? Well, no. Your diet seems quite effective, Boney. Very unexpected move for fish to talk in Japanese, right? It was my homeland. I lost it, but not my honor. You were some kind of a guard, right? I was the shadow over my demo. He's the most loyal person, and he's God. Were you a samurai? Right, samurai. It won't be easy to deal with you. But if you are here, doesn't it mean that you're dead already? My body, but not my spirit. When Master died, and his relics ended up here, my duty was to follow. I feel his death was my fault. And the only way my spirit can be free is a sacred death. So maybe we can kill you? Just a thought. No, I must do it myself. <sighs> but it is not possible in my current life. I have no hands. Also, this room is a soul proof. No soul can leave its walls. Stay afloat. Let's check the trick. Look, Demon. Our phone jumped over a few generations. That's what I call a real upgrade. Wow, already with SIM. I'll save the number for some other time.
Oh my gosh. This idea is brilliant. What idea? Freeze electronics to eat them later? You can cool down your food and your farm at the same time. What this thing do? I have no idea. Something with zero and one. And raise your electricity bill. Hey, little bird! Please sit. And I'll turn the electricity on. Who said that? Who's supposed to? The house owner. Welcome, uninvited guests. I don't trust this place, brother. Trust my gut feeling. Of course you don't. The digital world means nothing to you, silly little people. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Watch your mouth! I have almost millions of subscribers. I'm not like my buddy. Sorry, Dimon. You're cool. Can we kind of chat with you? Huh, not a problem. But I'm not sure if you are mentally capable of talking with me. Please, Angelo, let my fist kiss one of his faces. Are you some program? Like in Matrix? Very intelligent chatbot? And not well-mannered. Hmm. You make me ponder. Not expecting. Paradox, but I'm not a bot. But at the same time, I am. Or I have become. I was a person that any other who don't know much about computers would call a hacker. Oh yeah, my aunt called me a hacker. For helping her post a photo. When I was done with my life, someone decided that I deserve help for creating some software. But someone liked me, I guess, and put me in a perfect body. Digital one. You could be damn productive on the internet, living in digital form. No need to eat, sleep, talk. Yeah, that's why I died. But you were right. Surfing the net became much more effective and pleasant. I feel like a new god. Can you access a network? Watch the tube? <laughs> I'm controlling the tube from here. I just now realized that you are not lying. Two computers met in hell. You are cracking software. Crushing the work that people gave their life for. Destroying the natural right to buy, making developers' families starve and seek for better jobs. Are we finished? Think of it as a help for people that can buy something. We are two knights. You are the white one, and I'm the dark, stylish one. I'm the dark knight. Tell me about that ugly machine. Is that some portal? No, the portal is a chair near my face. That machine is called Upgrader 2.1 L3. It pushes any substance up to its limits by manipulating on subatomic level. So it makes nothing useful. Quite the opposite. Hell's coffee sucks, so I make it stronger like it should be. You said portal. To where? To the world of Lynn. Can you transfer me there, please? Both of us. No, the teleportation is temporary. I use it to get fertilizers and other stuff for my garden. You can take a look. Cool! Can't wait until our carriers use the same. Hey, Dimon, what is that white powder? Why are you asking me? Not my deal, yo. That's not mine. Easy, my friend. Let me read on a sack. Ah, it's only nitrate. Saltpeter. Let's take it. I heard it can be used in explosives somehow. Only 
robbed the rich. Bye, bloody rich. Okay, hacker. We need your help. Stay clear, human. We need your portal to the world of living. We must deliver a very important message to one person. It is possible, but you should do some work for me. Damn, hell! All I do here is... work! One of the trees in my garden needs more light. Fix this problem. How to bring the energy here? Hmm, some thoughts spinning in my head. Such a great feeling! I've got an idea how to get electricity to the lantern. Don't feel all kind of cliche. Sidekick for any hard task, you know. Ring, fix, fry your ass with lightning. Life writes our script, pal, and she is a bitch. Nice phrase. Deep. Yeah, let me write it down for some of my videos. How are you? Describe your feelings. Pull your pants down, jump in the frying pan, and you'll know. I think I saw that video. Bye, bloody rats. All right, boss. Work done. Isn't it weird when people make work for a bunch of transistors? In my world, it happens everywhere. New age, man. For machines. Okay, brain blocker. Time to perform your favorite job. Take a seat in that chair. Um, me? Life's a bitch, buddy. There's nothing bloggers won't do to get more views. Sounds of ripping reality. <coughs> Hello, ma'am. Can I see Mr. CEO? Identify yourself. Name, age, bank account balance. Well, okay. Angelo. Older than you think. And why the hell you need my balance? Mr. CEO won't speak with you if your fortune isn't big enough to make him drool. Listen, I have a message from his very important message. Believe me! Mr. Angelo, I trust nothing but papers only, not even the Internet. I classify people by two folders with journals. One carries the list of visitors. It's always on my left. The second one is for checking special personnel who fix, clean, and are being paid poorly. Always on my right side. So just drop a line in the visitors list. It is impossible. Visitors can be added only by Mr. CEO's direction or to comply with his requirements. You look like a teenager who doesn't know what to do. Also, you're neither rich enough nor famous. And there's no dirty work here that I can give you either. Look, I'm a blogger. It is very useful for Mr. CEO to talk with me for his public image. That's true. Report to me the number of your subscribers. Um, a million. Almost. Sorry, Mr. Angelo. Only numbers starting from three million can make Mr. CEO grin. Did you hear all that lady said? I'm a bit afraid of her. Not 
No, too suspicious. People will shout such big increase in subs. In the end, I'll get more unsubscribes. Where is this money coming from? Stolen? It's hard to say this, but no. I'm planning to return to my world and don't want to meet that account holder. Please avoid unauthorized touching of anything here. Maybe I need to visit the WC? I don't have you on the WC visitors list. <laughs> Fancy hardware. What a fancy coffee machine you have. Do you brew it for people in another special folder? I operate this machine when Mr. CEO wants me to. Let him take my free advice. It's harmful to drink a lot of coffee. Caffeine helps Mr. CEO to get through the thrill when the stock exchange rises. You need to graduate from an expensive college to touch them, young man. You need to graduate from an expensive college to touch them, young man. Think, think, think! Doesn't help. Nope. <coughs> it says, young sharks required to eat people. <coughs> Powerful woman, again. I saw your company is recruiting. How can I apply? What can you do? Well, I can ask people to donate to me while I'm relaxing. This skill can be marked as acceptable. Please give me your email. And the computer will send you an application form. I got IP. Just ask me when keyboard. If you need a bag. All right, do your trick. Make her boss cry while looking at his screen. I love to do the same for my viewers. Watch One change is done. Journals changed.
powerful woman again. Repeat the procedure. Oh no, the machine isn't working. You didn't try! Papers never lie, young man. But I have to bring Mr. CEO a coffee. It's a matter of life and death, literally. Well, I can deal with that machine, lady. Believe me. You really can? I was going to call a service, but you could try. Fix it faster. I'll try to calm him down with news about his competitor's bankruptcy. That's the kind of job I can handle. Okay, lady. Your infernal machine is fixed. But orders are orders. I must list you as a worker. Your name again? Angelo. Just Angelo. Is there some reward for helping? What did I tell you about touching them? Do it again. I need her out one more time. <laughs> Server security? Firewalls? IP tracers? Now the journals are back in their places. Could you check the visitors list again, please? Maybe you'll find my name. I checked not long ago, Mr. Angelo, and you weren't there. But you did me a favor, so as an exception, I'll look into it again. Hmm. Weird. Now I see your name. Written by me? Is that some kind of trick? Papers don't lie, remember? You may enter Mr. CEO's office, Mr. Angelo. Hello, Mr. Rich. You have 30 seconds for free. Then you either tell something useful for me, or pay me for talking. I can't help looking at your chair. I was expecting some classic seat, with maybe dragon's leather. The world is now functioning digitally. I need to see it naked and helpless. Got some VR trick to make people naked? My world's body is made up of my real estate. Money circulates in its veins. I am the brain. Do you have some kind of training in how to make money? Sure, I can teach you how to earn a million. It'll cost you two million. What's the sense in that? Then using that million, you earn three million and make a profit. Got the logic? It looks more like a battle plan than economics. Everything in the world is a battle. I have a message from your dad. Wait, what? Is my dear father alive? Well, I talked to him, but not sure about his physical status. So who the hell are you? I'm a messenger from hell. Well, well, well. 
so my dearest father is where he belongs. Great news. Now we can talk for free. What message did he send? He wants to warn you about his partners, who poisoned him. You have to look inside the Midas statue for papers that can help you withstand them. Good. So good. Glad to hear you're happy. But you have to tell me the password. Kind of delivery confirmation. Sure. But first, let me give another message to him. It was I who poisoned him. You? But why? Weren't you rich enough? Being his son! I was following his lessons. He always told me to be about profit before anything else. I found dirt on our competitors inside the Midas statue. It wasn't a very creative stash. I set up Daddy's partners with Father's death, used the dirt to finish off their business, and got on top. I've implemented the most effective plan, in which Dad was... an obstacle. Now I'm even better than my father. He can be proud. Oh, and about your password. Deceive. Inveigle. Obfuscate. Hacker, please take me back to hell, cause I'm scared. Now, I know Kung Fu. Cry, bloody rats! Only rob the rich! Cry, bloody rats! Hold on, pal. I'll put you in a kind of social network. Only rob the rich! Just wait. Connection is still under construction. Good news! You're not alone! Call this number. It's the cure for loneliness. <sighs> I recall a girl on the street told me the same thing, and then... Don't continue, please. We'll shoot your story real good for my channel later. Work's done, boss, but there is a small detail. Cut the crap. Is my boy all right? Not bad, for sure. He tells you, deceive, inveigle, obfuscate. Oh, I'm such a proud father. My little nestling learned to fly. Damn, your family is a nest of vultures. Okay, boys. A deal is a deal. See that skull in the aquarium? There's a stamp inside that's required to exit hell. Now I wish we took that fishing rod. Now I'm ready to dive into anything, just to escape my work in hell. Forget what I said.
Looks like a place for putting the substance. You want me to go there? Maybe I'll become Super Demon. No, no, no. I can't take such a risk. Can you see the on button? No, I don't. We'll have to talk with tech support. The parrot is not your problem anymore. Your turn. Okay, what's the tech in action? I never knew that any white powder can be upgraded to this. Both things are deadly. Let's stop his alcohol problems forever. Will it detonate just like that? That colorful guy carries too much dark energy. It should work for TNT. Like a matchstick for a fuse. If King doesn't lie. What King? Dark energy? Sounds like a script. From some cheap adventure game. Look what I got. This thing will stop any headache. Thanks, buddy. Someday I'll make something for you too. <laughs> oh. I hope not. No head, no problems. Old law of life. When TNT meets real evil, heads always explode. All problems with one shot. Now he can't see the balloon, has no hole in his head, and seems to be happy. Love fishing? If it's about girls. Sorry, mate. I think it's a man. But sometimes it's hard to tell nowadays. For Una. That's probably how we look without a soul. I feel so cool and dangerous. I'm always cool, without any computer junk. Is this gonna help me leave hell? Bureaucracy everywhere, dude. It looks like the new host is much more calm.
train arriving in 2,000 years. Excuse me. We have a ticket and... What? Speak louder! We have a ticket! No need to shout, boy. Just give me a ticket. Oh, modern young people. Hm. Have no respect. So, we're back from hell. I can say this phrase all day long. What next? Maybe talk to Reaper? He must know all these other world formalities. Hi again. We should take you with us and leave you in hell. Greetings. Hi again. I was wondering. Hello. I want to go home. We can wait here until he sobers up or check the heaven side. Hello! I'm so happy to meet you! Is someone inside? Or it's talking light? It's me, the tram! My name is... Uh, I forgot, sorry. Where will you take us? Heaven, I hope? Above the clouds, to the place of peace and joy! I'm so happy to deliver you there! I was here before, and no one answered. As always when you ask for something good. Oh, I'm so sorry. Perhaps I was sleeping. It happens to me after that accident. Now I'm happy to help you. Happy guys always freak me out. Are you made in heaven? Low-tech angel? I'm happy you call me that. No, I know that heaven is not my origin. How's that? My new friends told me that in the past, I was a bad train. In a bad world. Do you remember something from the past? Not much. They flushed almost all my memories and repainted me. Somehow I have a flare of pink, and now I'm so happy. So it's not safe to drive to heaven? Oh, don't be worried. It was in my other life. Someone died? Um, I can't remember much. I recall tremendous speed, desert, and a hit. Oh, and some brutal white man with guns. And now you're happy. I know. We're ready. Warm up your engine, or whatever you have. Please enter and feel yourself happy. So, will it be a kind of vacation after hell? Well, we'll know it in the sequel. Let me turn on the appropriate music. Perfect place to advertise some music service. Write me, big companies. Oh, come on. Is there something fresh in your player? Nice! Now we can go. By the way, I still have that cocktail from the bar. So the trip won't be so boring. The damage he's done.